everyone, it's Jamie Lynn. I got some more of you questions that you sent in and I'm gonna answer them here for you. So I'm gonna start off with the first one from Layla Willow. And she asked me, what's the hardest thing about being in the industry? Um, I think that with every job and everything, like there's a good side and a bad side. I would say for me in this industry, it's a blessing to be able to travel, but it's also hard to be away from the loved ones. So I would say that's something that, um, you know, I struggle with. But, uh, but you know, it's also a blessing because sometimes I get to share that traveling with the people I love. So I'd say that's the hardest thing for me. The next one comes from Jamie YNN Fan. So it's not Jamie Lynn Fan, but it's Jamie YNN Fan 123. And she asked, what is your favorite memory while you were growing up? Uh, I have a lot of really good memories. I would say there was um there was a trip that I took for like two weeks and I went overseas and I was on the road with my sister and I got to see so many beautiful countries and it was just uh, one of those trips that um I, I kind of always remember. So I'd say that was one of my favorite childhood memories. Um, this one comes from Be Will Three Babies. What do you like to do in your downtime with Maddie and your family? Well. Sometimes, you know, we live really close to New Orleans, so we'll get a hotel and um, just go stay down there and kind of have a weekend of shopping and walking around on the river and eating some good food and, you know, just kind of getting away from everything and just having family time with just her and my husband. I think that's something that we all enjoy. <clears throat> and the next one is from Ready Set Rock 75. She asked, how old were you when you started singing? I think I've always been singing. Uh, maybe not professionally, but I've, I, I mean, I've been singing since I was very, very young. It's, it's something I've always loved to do. This one comes from Syro Kill, and they ask, who's your favorite singer? Uh, that's really hard. I have a lot. Um, I love, uh, I love Loretta Lynn, Dolly Parton, Garth Brooks. I love Rihanna. I love uh, you know, I love a lot of different people. It kind of goes all over the scale, but anytime I have to like answer that question, I always draw a blank. Um, the next question is from, hang on, let's let that truck pass. <laughs> Alrighty, the next question comes from LYS022. Are you thinking of making another music video? Yes, of course. <clears throat> I think one of the coolest things about making music is being able to bring the story to life and kind of tell your story. And it's fun to just, you know, kind of make a mini movie. So, of course, I want to do another music video. And Explicit Lovato asked, 80s or 90s? Well, I was born in 91, so I'd have to say I'm 90s, but I think it'd been really cool to be, um, to be alive during the 80s. So, uh, I don't know, but I guess I have to say 90s because I'm a 90s baby. The next one comes from... Iron Anchor and they ask what are your favorite workout songs? Well, <laughs> when I'm not too lazy to go work out, anything upbeat, you know, uh, gosh, that's hard. I mean, anything upbeat. Uh, I like Rihanna's stuff, I like Beyonce stuff. That's always like kind of like a motivator for you to be like, you know what, it's time to get in shape. So those are good ones to work out to. This one comes from Draw Time 24. What is the most unique Thing a fan has ever done for you. I've had a lot of really cool things that my fans do. They take the time to like make these collages and I mean they get in detail and you know they put pictures of my little girl in there and I just think that's so sweet but one time I had a fan make me a bracelet that was um, made out of little hem made it was like a target flame but it was like she cut up little hem books and she wrapped them around the bracelet and made a bracelet out of it. it was really really cool and I thought it was really unique I'd never seen anything like it so that was a really unique gift. The next one comes from Army of Brittany, and it says, what is the longest you've gone without sleep? I mean, I would say I've gone a day without sleep, but I, I like sleep, so I try to fit that in anywhere I can. I don't care if I'm on the airport floor, I don't care where it is, I've gotta get sleep, but I would say a day would probably be the longest I'd ever gone. The next one comes from Baby Fan Brittany, and they asked, what languages would you like to learn? Well, I, I took French in school, and obviously I didn't, you know, really try that hard. And I would like to go back and, um, you know, to do that and just accomplish it because I started it, so I need to finish it. But those are all of your questions. Thank y'all for sending them in. I love hearing from y'all. If you like this video, then hit the like button and subscribe. And be sure to comment below your questions for my next video. Thank you guys. Bye.